Hey, good evening. Happy Sunday to everybody out there in Internet Land, and welcome back to the DZMC Gaming Channel. Uh, we're going to go in and take a look at our UK turn. Probably only going to be able to take the UK turn tonight. Um, so let's see what happened. Let's see what the uh, Germans did. They didn't attack this. Didn't attack this. Did attack this. And this. So, hmm. Boy, we could buy a complex here, you know that? I don't know if that helps us really, though. We have to build for here, here, and here. Hmm. Uh, let's see what he did. Purchased 14 infantry and a fighter. And. Like Algeria. Vologda. Oh, you'd think you would have left that for the Japanese, dude. They're the ones that need the money. <laughs> uh, no units lost yet. See, Belgian Congo, okay, destroyed a tank, did lose an artillery. Germany won to Terry, destroyed one artillery, no, he is lost in battle. Okay, well, we can't stack this quite yet. Looks like he put another two guys here, too. So. Gonna continue to stack this. Four and then another four. That's eight. We're not we need to send more guys. We're not sending enough guys. I really can't afford to buy. What would it what would we have for so twenty-eight? Uh, we're gonna pick up whole heck of a lot, actually. Could go down here. One, two, three, four. That's not ideal. His plane cannot reach. Hmm. Fleet needs to be here. Hmm. Actually, it doesn't all need to be there. Kinda does. <laughs> However, I do not need to destroy or block him. I think we ran the math on this. I think I have like he has like a very well. Maybe we should run it again just to make sure. Let me pause it here so you guys don't have to wait. Hang with me. Okay, so. Um, if I if I don't send a carrier there for some reason and two extra planes, actually we still have a, and he has all of his subs, we actually still have a 36% um, chance of holding this. So well, I think what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to do something that I don't normally do. I'm going to send the one infantry here to attack this with all of the planes. They can all land back here. And... Don't know why my dog's barking, but um, if I lose a plane here, actually it's okay because I'll be able to hold this f indefinitely. It will pay for itself. 
Um, I think I'm going to take a chance on that. So I'm not going to build any ships this turn. don't think I have to because the United States can build four and the maximum he can really build is four. And we can actually build seven if we need it to. So I'm going to build to get some mobility here. I think we can afford three tanks. No, we can't. Can't even afford that many. So we have to go two and one. And then we need to build four for here. One, two, three, four. So that's gonna that's gonna play that out. I was thinking about putting these US fighters here. I still might do that depending on how this battle goes. But if we can grab this, then we should be able to sneak on over and pressure this consistently. Yeah, babe? Hold on. Yeah, I am. Let me just... Pa I'll pause it. Sorry about that, folks. Okay, so I think I'm going to do that. And leave open the opportunity for him to slip in through here if he wants to. Oh, no. He can bring two, three, four, five... He'd have to grab this with the Japanese or something. But he would be able to bring his bombers. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, if he got this with the um, Japanese, he could land his bombers here and take this from us. But we're going to build. This guy's going to go back, actually. So, we're, yeah, we'll be okay here. I'm going to build three for here. Three, four, five, six. Plus, could always land an American there too if we needed to. We'll see how the see how it looks. All right, so we'll go with this, and uh, we'll do just that. We'll attack with this. Fighters. Bring these two. And the bomber doesn't he doesn't need to go up here yet. Pretty sure uh, ten fighters, well, eight fighters can take this out. One would hope. I've got to disengage here, don't I? I forget to do that. That would have been a huge mistake. That's it. And if we lose that transport, it's okay. Okay. Well, that's... Mind you, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, four. Um, five, four, five, six, four, five, six. Bombers can't reach there. Technically, his planes could, but they'd have to 
they'd have to congregate here. And he, that means he'd have to build units here. Well, maybe not that many. Well, we're building transports next turn, so hopefully we're building transports next turn. It's going to be messy. This is going to be messy to navigate this. Really need to win this. Might try to keep this low. Well, transport's not going to move. I could put a destroyer there, but then I'd have to destroy the block, which I could do. You have no air air support. Well, let's try it. We'll see. Let's go. No hits back. That's what I care about. Ah, I got one. Actually, we'll take the plane, like we said. All right. up there. Um. Hmm. I got my subset to submerge though. Uh. could take this and bring all of his bombers though, but I, god, I would just kill that though, wouldn't I? You'd have to, I mean, they'd have to land here, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. I would have the opportunity to take it back though. With the um with the US fleet. We want the we want the US we want the fleet here now in 36. That's what we want to do. And we'll build subs. If he wants to come at us with subs or destroyers to kill subs, we'll just keep killing them back. We'll build a complex here. It's messy, but now that the UK is here, that's fine. UK can build a complex now. We'll be able to deal with all of this. Although, is that smart? <laughs> I don't know. We don't have the income. Well, we might. 32? How does that give us? That means we can build 
10 or 8 units plus 2 artillery, that's 10. So we're going to build 4 here, 7. So it's, ex it's 11. We need more income. Maybe we do. I don't know. Keep this. I don't think he'll see that anyway. He don't, I don't think he'll see that. He might. more useful here. Just, I'm so impatient right here, and I, I practice, I pr should practice what I preach, right? Patience, patience, patience. I need to exercise patience here. So we'll be doing that. I don't know if I need that sub here, though. He doesn't know that I have my submarine set to submerge. Which, by the way, I really shouldn't have that on now, anyway. I should change that right now. It won't matter for this battle, because apparently it doesn't take place until your next turn. <coughs> I could send two subs after, but I can, they're much easier to kill when they're here. I don't have to worry about losing a destroyer to do it. You know, I can kill it and then get him back, right? I'll have to move more subs down. That's his play. At least I think that's his play. All right. Well, let's let's go with this. Tank. Um, we have the artillery there. We need one there. Two infantry and three infantry there. 32 for the UK. So what's its lead now? 191 and 180. Jeez. Man, Germany's at 101. We're at 106 <clears throat> between the two of us. It's close. The game is actually really close. Well, we'll call this a turn, folks. Thanks for watching. And uh, hit the like button, hit subscribe, hit the notifications bell. And, uh,. We'll come back at you on the U.S. is uh, round seven turn, Russia round eight turn. Still very much in the air, this game. Very much in the air. The KJF, the Money Islands, has been proven to be uh, pretty costly and difficult to navigate. We've got to start pushing him back, but Russia's not really in a huge position to do that yet. Actually, probably ever. Um, so once we can secure the bottom half of this, we can start to move out on... We'll build some guys up here and start to move on Africa that way. So thanks for watching, folks. Really appreciate you.